Assalamu alaikum, this is Fayal Malik from the Fox Creative Studio and I'm here with the second part of our last video that was on Adobe Capture CC. As I told you in our last video that Adobe Capture CC is a very handy app for all the creatives and designers out there. So uh, in our previous part, we discussed about creating patterns different patterns instantly without using any complicated software like photoshop illustrator or you didn't need any kind of hand drawings it was all you need was your mobile and this app so uh in my last video you can see how we created fun patterns and converted them to in our photoshop and uh, played with that so uh in this part i'm going to discuss the other two features of the Let's open this app and have a look at it. This is how the app is. The first thing we'll discuss about finding the colors from your live environment. For example, you are in an environment where you can see some popping colors or very appealing colors and you want to save them for your further use uh, where you can use them in your designs or in anywhere. Uh, this is the environment for instance i'm uh, having very colorful environment and want to save few of these colors so uh, what i'll do is i'll open this app and go to the option colors which was already open so uh, i'll just what i'll do is i'll just tap this video on the screen and first i'll look around which part of this uh, environment i'm getting more appropriate colors which i want i guess the here we go here we go here we go so i'm just tapping the screen freezing it and then adjusting the color tones which i want to save for example i want this yellow color i want terracotta here it is the shade of green the very pretty blue and the green shade we will be choosing i guess this color this which color should i choose let's say this darker green okay this is the palette i want to save and use it in my further design composition what i'll be doing is i'll be selecting it and pressing ok uh, here we can see different levels which we can treat and change the hues and balance our colors. Here we have got the option of harmonies and this is it where it is the our, uh, image, the actual image we have uh, used to create these colors, to pick these colors. What we'll be doing is we'll just forward from here and save it to our library now one thing you have to make it clear your your adobe capture has to be synchronized with your creative cloud application on your desktop whichever the id you have been using in this adobe capture app it must be there in your adobe creative cloud application so uh, this way it will automatically get synchronized with your photoshop illustrator and other adobe apps and you will be easily shifting these data pictures and whatever we'll be saving patterns fonts whatever uh, directly to your libraries and there you can get access to it straight away so uh, i'll be saving it and the library which i'll be using is the should i make it a new one i'll be using the previous one that is lecture one so i'll be saving it here uh, now we'll be looking at our photoshop and see how these colors have been transferred to our computer mine is already synchronized so let's get back to the photoshop uh, so i'm opening a file of 30 by 30 inches with 300 resolution and we'll try to create something with the colors that we have selected so this is created 
Now first thing we'll do is grab the libraries out of the window section. Here's the windows. Let's go up to it. Find library. And here we've got those swatches that we pick from the environment from the picture that we just saw. So uh, these colors I'll be picking one by one and this start showing here in swatches. So let's get started. Thank you. 